This country is afraid of me. I've seen its true face. The liberals and intellectuals and smooth talkers suddenly have nothing to say. They'll climb from under their pile of sex and communism and yell, save us. And I'll whisper, no. <sighs> well, that's all the time we have today for the Rush Limbaugh Show. Join me tomorrow for my special on the myth of oxygen and how the drive-by media wants you to believe that it's created by trees. And we're out. Great job, Rush. Make it dittos. Thanks. They all think I'm this clown, a pretty face behind a microphone. They haven't seen my true face. They haven't seen... Russia. <laughs> Saw a discarded sandwich on side of road. Tire tread on broken Kaiserol. Still tasted pretty good, though. All the socialism and midnight basketball in the world can't stop these punks from destroying the city. No! No! Hey, man, come on, man. They told us to, man. They told us to fuck, man. They told... Only I can stop the spread of their disease. Huh. Hey, I'm the manager here. I paid these boys to paint this. No compromise. What are you doing here? Hello, Miss Coulter. Had to talk to you about something. Help myself to some pills. Hope you don't mind. Someone's trying to take out Barack Obama, and we need to stop them. Why? Because, Anne, he's the only thing that's keeping us relevant. If a Republican gets back into the office, we'll be nobody's again! Oh my god. What can we do? They're planning on telling the nation that Obama was born outside of the United States. No, I've already looked into that. It turns out Hawaii actually is a state. No. They've forged a Kenyan birth certificate and plan on revealing it to the nation. We've got to find them, torture them, and kill them. Why do we have to torture them? That's liberal talk. That was great. No one makes love like a conservative. Pitch black missionary or all free love. Care for another round? I think one of these is a Viagra. No. Fair enough. My sources have led me here. Had to break three fingers to get this far. Accidentally sat on them while trying to get into my Corvette. Whoever's behind this door plans on taking down a president. And I'm going to stop them. No. Hello, Russia. Impossible. You're going to destroy your own presidency? For the good of mankind. I'll be kicked out of office. The election results will be invalidated. And John McCain will become president during the worst economic times in American history, crippling the Republican Party forever. But I need you up there so people listen to me again. Without you, I'm just another fat, screaming, windbag drug addict. I'm Al Franken. This isn't about you. All I care about is destroying Americans' dependence on foreign oil. I'll stop you. I'll tell the world. You think I'm afraid of looking crazy? I said Michael J. Fox was faking Parkinson's, for Christ's sakes. Oh, tell you what. Oh. You let me get away with this, Ugh. and I'll give you the skull of Reagan. Ronald or Nancy? Ronald. Throw a Nancy, and you have yourself a deal. Nancy Reagan is still alive. Do we have a deal? <laughs> Ha 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 